Here I have a Clark air compressor. It's a small one, uh, pretty cheap. Not really worth fixing, but I'm gonna try to anyway. So the problem is, I think the uh, the piston seal or the piston ring is uh, worn out on it. What happens is uh, fills up the tank with air, but then it all leaks out this uh, oil cap here. There's a vent on the top. I'll uh, I'll try to show you quickly. I don't know if you can hear that, I'll try to get the camera closer. That hissing sound, that is uh, coming out here. And this is, this is just the oil uh, fill up plug. So the, the air is just draining through there. And I've been told that's the uh, piston ring. So I will try and replace it and I'll let you know how it goes and I'll show you some how I do it in between. So here I got it all taken apart. Um, first thing you want to do is totally drain the air. Drain out of the tank with the bleeder valve on the bottom. Uh, wait until this stops uh, hissing if that's the same problem you have. And uh, pull, the, uh, pull the drain on the uh, regulator too. So once that's done, I uh, disconnected the air hose from the uh, piston head here. And then uh, after that, I removed this plastic, or tried to at least, loosened it off so it would come back. And then after that, I removed these head bolts here. Um, and then took the head off. And then after that, I... Uh, Remove the bolts down here. That's the, uh, actually, yeah, that's the cylinder head, I guess you could call. Um, remove those bolts there, pulled that off. The piston came with it, just this the way this one's made, how the piston sits in there, it kind of just slid off and came with it. The, it did not, ha it doesn't really have, uh, kind of has like a journal bearing on this one, I guess you could say, where the oil uh, lubricates it. And then, yeah, there are just some uh, gaskets and small pieces down there. Um, all comes apart pretty easy on this model. Uh, I'll have to replace this gasket. It's garbage. It's just flaking. So, uh, yeah, it's not a big deal. But, yeah, um, the piston rings, I don't know. They, they don't look bad, but... Uh, I guess I'll try replacing them if I can uh, find the right part and I'll uh, see how it goes. The uh, the inside of the cylinder didn't look too bad either for uh, wear, but it's hard to tell, I guess. I'm no pro at this. But yeah, I'll see, I'll see if I can find the part and I'll uh, try to get it working again.